back to my channel. How are you guys doing? Today I'm doing my Ipsy unbagging, but I'm doing it a little differently since I mainly got face products where I can put on. I'm gonna apply whatever I got onto my face. I finished everything else, whatnot, and then I'm gonna put that on to show how it goes on that way. Because sometimes, most of the time, I do the swatches, and you guys don't get the feel of it. Sometimes you see a swatch and it looks nice on the hand or it looks like crap. And then you put it on your face and it's the opposite. So I'm going to do it this way since I mainly got face products. But I'll go through everything I got first and then go from there. Um, first off is I got a brush uh, cleaner by Jap Japan K, whatever. I have a lip gloss from them from BoxyCharm, I think. This is a solid brush cleanser, gentle coconut cleansing balm. Um, I looked it up. This is, you can get this at Ultra. Um, it's $20 and there's like a coupon for it too, which is pretty neat. Next is this Luna highlighter. This one's in Calypso. This one is, how much was this one? It's $23. The Ipsy has their little dills that they have. I'll swatch it and show you and then I'll put it on. This one's pretty. I like it. I don't have a highlighter like that. Next is NYX Lutter, Lutter, London Butter Lipstick. This one is in Lifeguard. It's a real pretty dark crimson red. I'm going to put that on today. And then um, I got Hidakari. I think that's how you say it. This is a cream pigment. This is in Latte. I think the site, um, when they sell the not the samples but the actual product it's in a glass one this one's real pretty I'm gonna put this on in the middle today and it's real pretty and it's shimmery looks like I'm gonna put it on my hand it's like a bronzy look and it doesn't really feel that creamy it just feels like a normal well I guess it is cream. It feels like butter but it's not like a cream pigment that I think it'd be like, you know it's kind of smushy and then I got a fan brush. So I'm going to use this fan brush. This one's by Royal London. Oh, I didn't say the price of this. This one is $13 on site for the full price, which isn't bad. And then a London Royal Nickel brush, fan brush. I tried to look up on the site uh, how much it is. Um, I, I couldn't find it. They had other brushes, but I couldn't find this one. This one's neat style. And I got this one, so I'm going to compare it to the one I got in Boxy. I'll put one on each. And I think this one was $18. i am not, I wish I found the price on this. I'll look at it more. And then, oh, and then this is a little card. Ipsy Much Love. Little bag, it has a little text message. And then the bag. I've seen a lot of debate going on about this bag. It's cute, but it's kind of interesting because it's denim and it has neon. Not bad. Right. It's like a neon orange. It's cute, but it's just different. It'll probably last a while because it's denim. Denim lasts a while. Okay, so I'm gonna get in and I'm gonna start playing this so it's not too crazy, too long. I'm gonna use a flat brush from Medusa. I got another one in here just in case this one doesn't do the work. But I'm going to put the Hedkari Latte on. I'm going to put that in the middle. Goes on the brush pretty well. It doesn't look clumpy. Let's see. Can you see me? I'm going to try to put this up here more so you can see me. That's pretty. And it blends out pretty easily. It is pigmented, in my opinion. I like it. My face is coming out in a weird color on this camera today. Well, it's not a camera, it's my iPhone. I like this one. Is it? 
sorry, I have hooded eyes, so it's kind of hard to see and stuff. I like it. I might add a little bit more. Yeah. This color will probably work with the other one. I did brown, so it's easy, simple. I don't know how it worked with a blending brush, but I use a flat one because they said cream, so I'm like, eh, that'll be best to go on. You know, I think I want to put on the bottom too. I'm going to just turn it over and use the... This one. I think I might go check it out on the site and go buy it because it's but the other ones are like this one where it's pretty. I like it. Can you guys notice it? All right, next I'm gonna try the Luna. I think this is actually the actual size for it. Actual, actual, how many times am I gonna say it? The original side, it's very shimmery. All right, where is this? Do this, this one's thicker than the other one, so let's see how this one works. I always have a hard time with these fan brushes. You can't really pick up the pigment too much. Oh, you can see it. Oh wow. That is sparkly. My skin looks like crap today. See all my freckles and discoloration? show you. I didn't really pick it. This one isn't as thick. Mm. Yeah, I don't think I care for this one too much. This one picks up more product. It comes out a little purplish. A little purple tint. My face all broke out. I hate it when that happens. Alright, next I'm gonna try the London Butter. But I'm gonna. This is an effoliant from e.l.f. Mint. I really like this. Usually I have the little little pod thingy my bobber. Sorry, I need to wipe it. And I don't I don't like digging my fingers in those. Because I never can find my lip brushes. And then I'm gonna put a little bit of this on just in case. This is Katie. Rimmel. But where did I where did I get this one? I think I got an empty last month. Alright, I'm gonna put on the red. Pretty red. It might be too dark though. Yeah, right now it said it was 350 and it's on. What do you guys think? I like it. It's pretty, it's smooth. And 
on the site it said it was on sale for $3.50 and then they give you a code. I think 30% off. That's not bad. Well, you what, pay two dollars and something? I think I have another color of this London butter. I like this one. This one's Lifeguard. But yep, yeah, that is my Ipsy bag. I'm gonna finish the rest of my makeup by adding a little bit of eyeliner and mascara. But the eyeshadow, the latte is pretty, the lipstick's pretty, the highlight showed up pretty well. And I like this fan brush better than the one I got in the Ipsy. I mean, Boxy Charm. One of the box. boxes I get. Um, this one, what I got, it's pretty worth it. I've been really happy with everything I've been getting with Ipsy and Box Charm, but Ipsy, I'm going to try out this brush cleaner. I've never had a balm brush cleaner. I have a liquid one. I'm going to probably use it tonight. Clean all my brushes because they need to be cleaned. can't open it to show you what it looks like inside. There it goes. One more lick. Oh, it does smell like coconut. I don't even know how to use it. I'm going to have to look to see how to use this type. But that's pretty much it. Let me know if you like this better where I apply it on to see how instead of just the swatches. Just let me know. Uh, like and comment below. Thank you for watching. I do appreciate it. And my new subscribers, thank you. Have a great day.